Hey guys, I just finished this um, this little painting I did. I used my Japanese watercolor. I got I have it in this um, cigar box that I I really like. It it fits all of them, and I got a whole bunch of them that I got to put away <laughs> that I used. I, I'm letting them sit out, but I just wanted to kind of take the tape off in front of you guys. Because that is the best part of the painting. <laughs> oh yeah, it's looking nice. I want to see what, if I can move this just a tiny little bit. Okay. See it bouncing? This is like this um, camera holder that doesn't seem to work very good. Hey, I don't know if I told you guys. I mean, some people know. But um, in, on August 6th, this doctor will tell me when they're going to do surgery on my leg. It is so exciting because I have been in pain and it's only gotten worse since 2006. It has been a really terrible ride for me. And, you know, I know other people have worse things happen to them. So, you know, I'm glad I'm alive and I'm glad I'm able to still walk. You know what I mean? Not very good, <laughs> but and my the mechanism inside my knee that I told you about um, has shortened my leg because the metal had jammed up in there tighter into my into my bone, and it's all it's all messed up. Well, anyway, she looked at me and she goes, "Okay, so we're gonna put a, a spacer in, in your leg, in your knee, and we're gonna keep it there forever, so you won't be able to bend it, but." You won't be in any of this pain. And I just, my my jaw dropped um, to the floor and tears came out of my eyes because I can't imagine what that even meant. I have no idea what that meant. Um, yeah, so, and I already can't bend my leg because of this mechanism. So I'm used to having a straight leg, but... Um, it, they're going to make my leg the correct size. So I'll be five foot 11 again <laughs> and not five, seven or six. Or I, I, I feel like I'm even five, four when I stand on that leg. I'm so tiny and short. Um, but things, um, yeah, it turned out really good for me. I'm, I'm really happy. I think, um, I'm excited. I'm not nervous at all, and I do have a nervous condition and, and an anxiety disorder, so it's pretty cool that I don't feel that way. Um, yeah, so I just want to share that with you guys, and um, I hope you like my painting. You know, you know how I did this? Let me show you. So years ago, I bought this um, frame that you put like it, it comes it's it comes with like a whole bunch of little um little holes that you could put lots of um pictures in and in the middle there was this thing and it's a tree and i taken it off i was like i can use this for something and so i roll i i put um brown acrylic fluid um the liquid of fluid uh liquid tech sorry fluid paint on it and Hold on, let me let my dog out. And I pressed it down like a stamp. Boom. <laughs> and I think, I think it came out really kind of cute. And then I did other designs on it and stuff prior to that. But, um, yeah. So this is all done with the Japanese paint. And um, the, the brown part is um, acrylic. So I think it looks pretty good. So I just wanted to share that, that news with you and share my painting with you. <laughs> hey, thanks for watching, guys. Bye-bye. Let me see if I can make this bounce. See, what? See, watch. Boingy, 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 <laughs> boingy, boingy. This was great, this thing that I bought from Amazon to hold my camera to my desk. This is just wonderful. Bye-bye. <laughs>